Hello, this is a quick demo and overview on how to take chatter posting, postings and push them to Slack. So really quick, let me show you the demo. Oh, shoot. So really quick, let me show you the demo. If I start on the case record, I'm just gonna go ahead and at mention um, someone and um, type in a message. Go ahead and share that. Um, and let's take a look at what that looks like in Slack. So we have a couple of options. So here is going to a generic uh, Slack channel. Um, you can see that the message came through with the at mention. We also have another option where the message goes directly to the user. Um, and you can see here it's go into my central app in the messages section posted the message and also linked the record where the chatter post occurred. Now let's take a look at the flows that gave us those two results. So first is the generic post, a relatively simple flow. We're starting with a record trigger flow, record trigger flow on the feed item, which is a, uh, which is what is chatter is. We have a handful of variables that we are creating, so that way we can pass that information into the message, such as the case record ID, the um, chatter message body, et cetera. So you can see those here. And then we're using that send for notification Salesforce flow element. We're setting it to a static channel here. We're passing in the variable of the chatter message body and that completes that flow. Now let's look at the more complicated version where we're basically selecting the user in which we wanna to send to. So again, it's a record triggered flow on that feed element like we had done before. This time we have a custom invocable Apex um, component. Um, in Salesforce flow, you cannot um, query the app mentions. And so we wrote a little apex to get those. Um, if you decide to go with this method, let us know. We have that apex and that test class that we can share with you. Then because there can be multiple app mentions, we want to loop through those user IDs here. Um, that's a pretty straightforward loop. We're going to loop through that collection variable. That's the output of that apex action. Then we're going to get the user IDs that are um, the output of that. So that way we have first name, last name, and we can also get the Slack um, user ID. So that's just a get records um, component there. Finally, uh, similar to the previous flow, we're gonna set a handful of variables. We're gonna set the Slack user ID, case ID, and then the chatter body. And finally, in the Salesforce excuse me, Salesforce flow element of our send for notification. Notice here in the past, we've only set these as channel IDs, but you can notice that we can also set it as a user ID variable, which is what we're doing now. We have our message included here. And then finally, we are attaching a record of that case ID where that's what's linked to that feed item. So those are the two options on how to post things to Chatter. Let me know if you have any questions.